To add users to a class, please make sure that you use the seat management widget by clicking the manage seats button. The only time that you should use manage users is if you are adding a teacher or a catechist to the class as an instructor. To begin the process of adding students, click on the manage seats button. From there, you'll see the number of seats that you have remaining and you'll have the ability to add users. Click the add users button. If you have users that are in the system from a previous year, you can add the users from an existing class. If not, and they're new users, you have two options. The first is to add the users manually. You can click add users individually, type in their first name, their last name, and their parents' email, and then click add users. Once you've done that, you can click submit, and that will add the users to the class. The second option is to do a bulk upload of users. In order to bulk upload users, download the template file. Once you've downloaded the template file, please fill out the student's first name, the student's last name, and please put the parent's email address for that student in the secondary email field. Once you've completed that, go ahead and do a file and save as, and save the template as a CSV under whatever name you would like to your computer. Once that's been saved, go ahead and click on the Select Files button. When you click on the Select Files button, you'll find the file that you've just saved and click Open. You'll see here that now all the new users that I'd like to create are ready to go. I'm able to see their first name, their last name, their username that's been created by our system, and their parents' email. If I'd like to edit any of that information, I can, or remove a student if I realize that they were uploaded in error, I can do that here. Once I've reviewed the information and I know that it's correct, I can go ahead and click the Submit button. I've now added those users to the class, and I'll be returned to the main screen where I'm able to review the information once again and send login emails to those users. Thank you so much for allowing us to serve you and have a wonderful day.